we also have to start getting ready for Halloween or the weather <laughs> on Halloween because we know the weather is always going to be awful on Halloween. Yes. Why can't we have 70s this year? <laughs> hey, Ashley, why can't we have 70s this year? I have can, a question we, from the crowd. Can we just bump up, you know, the whole festivity part yeah, of it for tomorrow? Like yeah, do it now. Yeah, let's, let's just go. do it tomorrow. All right, kids, trick-or-treating officially tomorrow. <laughs> but no, I wish that we could hold on to these conditions into early next week, but we're tracking some big changes. And so we have some extreme weather shifts in our near forecast. So that also takes us to new climate central data coming in about Halloween extremes and how Detroit is actually experiencing warming October nights. We're just not going to get that warm up going into next week. So the official warmest Halloween that we have on record 79 degrees and that was set all the way back in 1950. The coolest 21 degrees in 1988. This one you might remember more closely because it was only 10 years ago, but the rainiest Halloween we ever had, we picked up over an inch and a half of rain and that was back in 2013. So how is this Halloween shaping up? Well, it's going to be probably dry as of right now, looking dry, but breezy and cloudy upper 30s come trick or treat time. So